You're tuning into Black and White Sports on YouTube. The no holds barred truth on sports. The main event starts now. Black and White Sports fans, it's been almost a month now since Colin Kaepernick actually had his workouts with the Las Vegas Raiders. And there has been no reports of Colin Kaepernick working out with another team, even getting an opportunity to work out with another team. And I don't believe that the Raiders will actually offer him a contract. Now, the Raiders already have three quarterbacks on the roster. That is a ton of quarterbacks. Colin Kaepernick has been out of the league since uh, 2016. Remember, he opted out his contract. He opted out his contract. That is on him. He was never blackballed from the NFL. But of course, you know, the woke media out there has been out there spreading a lie that Colin Kaepernick was cut. He was not. He opted out of his contract. Remember, he was so bad on the field that he got benched for Blaine Gabbert. And then after that, he started kneeling for the national anthem. And when you have as much baggage as you do with uh, Colin Kaepernick, and you don't also don't have the pro- productivity anymore, you're not going to get an opportunity. You're not. He is not worth the trouble. This man has trashed his country. He has been on the side of Marxism, supporting a communist like Fidel Castro. This is pretty bad, folks. But he did work out for the Raiders. And initially, this is what we heard. You can see here, this is dated uh, May 26, 2022. Colin Kaepernick's workout with Raiders went well in press per report. And you also had another report coming out as well that said Colin Kaepernick didn't blow anyone away during his Raiders workout, but it still went well. Now, this, of course, is coming from the media. Now, guys, I really don't trust the media that much. And if you actually do speak out against Colin Kaepernick, of course, you're going to be deemed a racist because Colin Kaepernick's social justice warrior has been out there talking about woke social justice and this kind of thing. And the media, the woke sports media has been bending down and praising him. And if you have any criticism of him whatsoever, you will be deemed a racist. So this is why I actually believe that the media was reporting that his workout went well. Now he did have, um, These throwing sessions out there on the field, no defenders at all, no pass rush at all. And he was actually missing some throws. He was actually under throwing some of the receivers here. Well, let's talk about Warren Sapp. NFL Hall of Famer Warren Sapp is not holding back on Colin Kaepernick's workout. And what he said goes completely against what the Walt Sports Media was actually saying, check this out. We're only going to listen to a little bit of this uh, YouTube clip here. Warren Sapp, I heard, I heard Kaepernick had one of the worst workouts ever with the Raiders. One of the worst ever. Let's check out a little bit of this here, guys. I mean, do you see Kaepernick coming back? I mean, he no. he tried out no. with the Raiders recently, but I heard the tryout wasn't all that great. I heard it was a disaster. I heard it was one of the worst workouts ever. I'm wondering how the hell this happened and the tape didn't get out, right? I mean, somebody wasn't over the bow, over the fence or nothing? Come on, man. We, we live in a world right now where you put a drone up. Hey, it ain't like they can stop you. They ain't going to stop the workout. Somebody there's a drone up here. We don't know who this is. I mean, what? Come on, let's let's, let's run this. They don't even send them up the, the, the ladder anymore. You remember we used to go out to practice? Send the guy up the thing. He's shooting practice off. <laughs> Unbelievable. Yeah, I mean, so that is what Warren Sapp had to say about Colin Kaepernick. He's not buying that Colin Kaepernick is actually going to play again. He said it was one of the worst workouts ever. And we have no footage of it whatsoever. I'm, I'm actually kind of surprised by that, too, that we don't actually have any footage on Colin Kaepernick. Now, when I initially heard about the workout, I wasn't really buying into that his workout was good, especially, you know, not for an NFL quarterback level. 
Colin Kaepernick hasn't thrown an NFL pass in six years. So I don't see how that workout actually did go well. You know, it wasn't probably just him playing catch. It's a little bit different, guys, when you actually uh, actually a lot different when you actually have defenders in front of your face. Kaepernick, Kaepernick actually likes to pull these stunts where he says, hey, I want to play. They're keeping me back. He's been given opportunity after opportunity after opportunity to get on with a team. But at the end of the day, he always destroys that opportunity. And now to me, he's washed up. He's too old. And I believe that Warren Sapp was probably telling the truth about Kaepernick's workout that, hey, it was a disaster and one of the worst workouts in the history of the NFL. That's just my thoughts on this. What do you guys think of this? Black and white sports fans, let us know what you think about all this in the comments. Make sure you subscribe to Black and White Sports, and we'll catch you next time. Black and White Network supporters, make sure you check out the Black and White Network merchandise store. Link in the description. Use promo code USA First, all one word. USA First, all one word. 25% off now. Thanks for watching the show. Be sure to like, comment, and subscribe. Be sure to tune in next time on Black and White Sports.